I'm not wasting a bit of this. I mean, like, I feel like you'd be a waste if you put it back in the box and then live your whole life wondering what's going to happen to it after you're gone. This is a World War II U.S. Army Air Force's air crew lunch. It weighs only 5 ounces, or 141 grams. This unique, easy one-hand manipulation dispensing carton could technically be opened with one hand, allowing the components to drop out of the selected compartment. Nice. Now, I'm not going to open it with just one hand. you got to be careful with something like this. 80 air crew lunches were packed to a 5-gallon can and set in a wooden crate for transport. That crate totaled to 32 pounds. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. We're gonna check this out. This ration's never been filmed before. Not once, by anybody. Probably never will be filmed mm -hmm. again after this. Oh, yeah. And just for formal purposes here, let's get this out onto a tray. Nice. This is, um... This is exquisite. <laughs> Chelsea. This is really up there. Extremely sweet. You ever like go on a long drive and you just need something sweet, something to chew on nice. to keep you awake. And you can't just keep drinking coffee. It's a diuretic. If you're flying, it's not something you want. This is what you want. This was a brilliant fashion. Oh gosh, that's so weird and awesome. This is the one that really caught my eye. I mean, you only get one. edible and delicious. I'm not kidding. It's a very soft and fine flavor right there. It's so easy to chew into. It's slightly granular. The oils aren't rancid at all. It's a little bit waxy and it's perfectly preserved. It was shipped from France. It cost me about $320, which I don't mind that at all. This is worth every penny. The only way you could smell what I'm smelling is if you go to a library and smell old books and then maybe like with a little chocolate background too. There's no way you could ever smell anything like this actually. Sorry. 